All right, we've got a third period in this hockey game. That's right, play against sports on top, only by one goal. I'm gonna ask that question, ladies and gentlemen. Who wants it more? That's right, this is a close hockey game and it could go either way. It comes down to who has the heart and whose skates are moving. We will find out in the rest of this game. Up the ice comes Kusterman. Kusterman passes that puck up. That puck is in the offensive zone for Cadillac though. There's a bunch of players down there working hard on the sideboards. Number 24 is gonna gather this puck up. Number 24 comes around the net. Tries to set up a center and pass, doesn't quite work. Mr. Kusterman's on the spot to come up the ice. Number seven and Kusterman come together. Fogman's gonna be in on a broken play. You know what's gonna happen here. What a beautiful goal. That was all stick handle in there, ladies and gentlemen. That was a deep, that was one of those deeps that fools anybody. Great goal by Xander Fogman, as it is a four to two hockey game. Alagos gonna grab this puck up. That puck is in the offensive zone for played against sports. Number 14 will pick up this puck. Morgan Barrett picks up that puck behind the net, comes out front, oh, sets up, oh, oh, that puck, that puck is not in the net. Oh my gosh, did you see where that puck went? Oh my gosh. Here comes Bel Air. Watch out, there's their player. He's gonna get up the ice again. He's in on the net, Minder. Oh my gosh, how did he score that goal? What a shot. Ladies and gentlemen, that's called a sniper shot as he went off the far post and in. And it is a four to three hockey game. Face off in the middle center. Centering dots. Ashley pushes that puck up. Lucas loses that puck in his feet. What do we got here? A stop of play. I don't know if he just moved the puck because there was no action or what, but that was one of the weirdest whistles I've ever seen in the history of hockey. Anyway, let's get back to play. Maybe the puck was inside someone's skate. I don't know. All right, we're at the face-off dots. Garner. Belair is back there with the puck again. Belair looking to pass to somebody. Nice little pass to Garner. Garner made a move. There's Belair. Belair is going to come up the ice. And an icing. Fogman backhand on the faceoff there. Keeps it under control. Fogman moves around the defense. Wow, almost had another goal there, but good defense by number seven, Ashley. Ashley's gonna push this puck up. Bo Klassen's tried to keep that puck in. Kusterman bringing that puck around. Hockey stops to reset. Pass over to Fogman. There's a lot of steam on that pass as Fogman couldn't quite handle it. Lucas is gonna go behind the net to get this puck out of the zone. Tried to push it out. Tryson Dexter is gonna come over to the corner. Oh, Kusterman's gonna have one of those long range shots it looks like, but good defense. Defense closed in on him quick. There goes Rodriguez. And an icing, or offsides. Alec Gosson face off that, still is not scored today. You know he's thinking it's gonna be his time soon. Alec gets that puck, as I said. 
Here he comes up the ice. Ellett makes a move. Good defense, though. Ooh. Adam Dean's gonna have a shot. Dean was the nice stick handle that couldn't get the shot away. Here comes Bel Air. Watch out. This could be a tie game. Bel Air takes the puck off the sideboards. He's back to the center. He has a chance. Defenders did converge on him. Thank God for that. That kid's a one-man wrecking crew. Four to three. We have a one-goal game still with 7.40. Four left in the second period. <clears throat> Behind the net comes Alec Goss. He gets his speed going. Here comes those Jets. Moving up the ice. Move to the center. Lose the puck for a second. But comes back. Passes over to Barrett. Barrett's got a chance. Barrett with a nice move of shot. Oh, she hits the back of the boards, but a good try. Tried setting up Barrett in front of the net. Did Alec Goss again. Didn't quite work out. Here she is again. Oh, yes. Barrett, Morgan Barrett puts that puck home. As when you work hard, you get a solution to a problem. And that problem was shots on goal and not many goals. But that time she said, I'm putting it in the net. It is a five to three game. Looks like. Played against sports is getting some space now to run away with this game. Gotta watch out for Bel Air though. Still trying to get Austin Cook his first goal. Just stay in front of the net. It might come to you, Austin. That puck comes from behind. That puck's gonna be pushed up. Evan Boss. Sawyer Stone passes that puck to the center. Nice push over there by the falling hockey player for Played Against Sports. I believe that was Schweitzer. Star with a backhand. Oh, wow. Austin Cook almost had his goal there. Wow, so close. All right, Star trying to set up Austin Cook. Boy, are we trying hard to get that little guy, that little guy a goal. Here it comes, hockey. Cadillac gold up the ice. Trying to cut this. Ooh. Bel Air is going to try to make something happen. Bel Air. Kusterman is going to gather this puck up with five minutes left in the third period. It is a five to three game. That puck is back in the Cadillac zone. Here comes Fogman with that speed. Here comes Fogman again. Good defense, though, by Bel Air. Kusman comes out, needs to regroup. Here comes Kusman up the ice. Kusman's going to have a chance. Nice block by Bel Air. Yeah. 
Offside. Elagos. Elagos coming in. Elagos with some fancy moves. A shot. Nice stop by the netminder. 24. Can Hockey Gold, Cadillac Gold, can they catch up and make this a one goal game? Alagos, pass over. Just lost that one. Those players are playing hard. The net miner will melt that puck down. So here's Stone. <coughs> there comes about Harp. <laughs> Offsides. Comes Kusterman. Nice save. We are down to two minutes left in the third period, and this has been a nicely, tightly contested hockey game. It is a two goal game. Nice hit by Belair, who will get a penalty for that. That was a good hit if we were in uh, Bantam Hockey, ladies and gentlemen, but we are not. And it is a five to three game with Cadillac's best player going to the Sinbin. One forty-seven left in the third. This game is all but over. Cadillac needs two goals to come back. Will Cadillac pull their netminder? I don't see that happening. Kusterman is in. Kusterman fans on a shot. Here comes Harp up the ice. Harp had a move, but good defense there. Garner is going to go in the corner to get this puck. All right. We are 37 seconds away from another victory. And Ella Goss is coming on the ice. He has not scored a goal all game. Could this be the last 37 seconds that he cashes in? He did have a really nice assist earlier with Morgan Barrett. But I wonder if he's thinking about a goal right now as this game comes to an end. Adam Dean pushes that puck back. Brandon Dean pushes that puck back up. Attempted pass to the center there. Morgan Barrett's going to pass over if it gets defended. Alagos gets that puck. Move to the inside. Move the out shot. Wow, that was a good chance. Good netminder there for Cadillac. This will do the game. Five seconds left. This will be the end, ladies and gentlemen. Elagos going to shoot the setup, and that will be the end of the game as playing in sports has brought it home 5-3. to three.
2 and 0 oh on this series of games between this team. Two games in two days, and they won them both, but very close games at times and not at others. But congratulations to both teams as they brought it both games. The score is five to three, and I am your announcer, Razor Razor Sharp, saying so long from Center Ice, Traverse City.